What's up guys, back at it. Day 14, vodka dosing, 55 gallon reef tank. Vodka. Got the little clown swimming through the rocks back there. All right, we look, things looking good. Got that snail making work of the overflow tube. There's all types of algae on there. He cleaned that whole thing off by himself. It's a beast. All right, so day 14. Same as always. Everything's looking okay. Uh, I just did the test results a few minutes ago. Just waiting on that. I figured I'd start this video and give you a little, little view of the tank. I was hoping that leather coral started looking better, but it's it's not. It's still the same. It's still the same. I was hoping it'd start opening up. That was actually really big and growing nice. Um, and I figured it started shriveling up because of the high nitrates. Uh, not sure. Or if that green hair is sucking all the phosphates in, I, I don't know. But I was hoping it would open because it was actually really nice and growing. But we'll see what happens. Hopefully, as the nitrates go down, it'll start getting better. And I can start putting a couple more pieces of coral in there. All right. There's a sump. There we go. Uh, if you could see the the, ch the chato in there, I had like a quart sized bag full of it. Uh, I got it for like ten bucks. Um, it's been in there for about two weeks, and it's falling all apart. I have I have no luck with it. This is the third time I threw chato in the in the refugium, and no luck. It falls apart, starts dying, gets all brittle. Um, I got an Aquion light on there. Um, I believe it's like a 10 watt. It's a half blue, uh, half white. Um, I did have a spiral CFL in there. Um, that didn't work. Um, that was like a 13 watt one. Um, give me some, uh, give me some feedback on what you think I should do, use, what kind of bulb, um, any luck you've been having. But yeah, I see all these other chados growing like crazy. Every two weeks, they gotta cut some out. Um, I can't grow it at all. Um, nitrates are high, so I know it's the nutrients are there for it. Uh, but yeah, give me some feedback, comment, let me know what you think. Sorry about that light, let me try to zoom in, all right, focus in there. All right, so we're day 14. Uh, test results, let me show you that real quick. Hopefully I don't drop a, another vial. Been having bad luck with them. Yeah, I dropped, I dropped two in a row. Um, there you go, guys. You can see it. Hopefully, good. Um, definitely focus in. There you go. Definitely 40 mark. Actually, looking a little clearer. Um, try to get a good view. There we go. That's pretty good. Hopefully, you can see that good. Uh, trying to get that through the white so you can see it. That's just a bubble moving. Um, but yeah, it's definitely getting, we're definitely at 40, and it's actually looking a little bit clearer, uh, getting towards that 20 ppm mark uh, nitrates. You can see right there, move my finger. Okay, so definitely getting clear. Um, this is the last day for one milliliter of uh, dosing. Uh, tomorrow we will up the dose. Um, you can see right there, one milliliter, 0.9, the next one is 1.0, okay? Um, let me shoot that in the sump. Right. right there. So tomorrow we're definitely, we're upping the dose for uh, another seven days, and that's going to be about 1.4, 1.5. Uh, milliliters all right and that'll be for seven days uh, straight of that and then um, hopefully this beneficial bacteria starts growing and eating all these nitrates up and I could kind of even everything out um, guys thanks for watching we got a, quite a few views on a couple of videos I know it's a long process but uh, thanks to everybody for commenting um, I did get back to everybody I think hopefully but uh yeah guys like subscribe comment share um do what you do all right
till tomorrow.